What up y'all, Matt Burke here again, coming to you from a house here in Tallahassee, Florida, and today's video is gonna be a pretty quick one. If y'all remember the video I put out a couple weeks ago skating those padded shorts, I'm here for just a quick update to show you guys what they've done as far as updates to the shorts since not only my video, but also Brendan's and some other people's videos have come out, and since we have shared some feedback with the team. I've never been involved in a situation where my feedback actually goes into changing a product. So it does feel pretty cool to have been involved in that in the minimal way that I was. So I am excited to show you guys what they have added and what they've changed in these shorts so that you guys can go out and pick up a pair of your own so that you don't end up falling on your ass and injuring yourself like I did so many years ago. So if y'all remember from that video a few weeks ago, I was talking about how there was some room for improvement in the shorts where they could have added some more padding in certain areas just to make sure that your body was as covered as possible. And it seems that the team over at D Moose heard not only what I was saying, but also what some other people that had been skating these shorts had mentioned to them as well, that we did need some areas to have a little bit more padding and we did need that tailbone to just be fixed a little bit. And while they didn't take any of the size off of that tailbone pad that keeps you covered back there, they did add a little bit of an indent down in the real tailbone area where your body curves so that it does fit in a little bit better. It does have a little bit more of a comfortable feel, but I've got to let you know from someone that has been skating these shorts exclusively for the last couple of months, that added layer of protection on the back there is something that I will never take for granted ever again. Just sitting down at the skate park now, for me at least, is a lot more comfortable than it used to be. I do have to mention that I literally have no butt at all. I have got nothing back there. I've got no padding at all. I cannot stress this enough. So when I sit at the skate park and I am sitting on these shorts, it literally feels like I'm sitting on a couch or sitting on some other very comfortable seating option. I'm not sure if that's gonna be a positive for everybody, but it is a huge, huge positive for me because again, I have injured my tailbone very, very bad in the past. I don't wanna do that again. And I also do just enjoy the comfort when I am sitting down. It's comfortable, I enjoy comfort and you should enjoy the same. But another really important update that they made into these shorts, you'll notice that there is a lot of padding now in the front hip area that wasn't there in the previous shorts that you guys saw in the last video. That is an area that I hit all of the time. I've been crashing into coping a whole lot lately and I've been falling right onto that area. Again, I am really tiny, so that is something that is really, really important to me because my hip bones do just stick out. So whenever I come down on those, that's something that'll take me out for a really, really long time. So it is something that I look for in a pair of shorts and these things have absolutely delivered in that regard by covering up that area as well as they do. You can see on the first pair of shorts that I have, if you can even see it here, but I have completely torn through the shorts on these things. They go all the way through to my boxers at this point, but they do still have the padding in there, which is really nice. In the second shorts, I've also, as you can see right here, I have torn through these shorts as well. I have not torn all the way through to my boxers yet, which is pretty ideal. I don't wanna rip through all of my boxers because that sucks. I've already ripped through all of my jeans. But as you can see, just to make my point, I fall on these things all of the time and they literally take so much of the fall out. I don't feel any impact. I don't feel any discomfort. These things are absolutely awesome. But I have been talking about these shorts for entirely too long at this point, so I am going to go ahead, break down this backdrop behind me, take down these lights, get rid of this microphone that is right here, let my dogs out of the crate, let my girlfriend out of the back bedroom where she has been waiting so patiently as I continually try to film this thing without messing up. It has been a disaster, but I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Whatever you do out there, enjoy these holiday seasons. Do not let seasonal depression get to you like it sometimes gets to me. It is a nightmare out there. You are a lot better than you are allowing yourself to believe. I think that you're fantastic. I love you guys. Thank you so much for sticking around with all of the nonsense that I have put you through this year. I hope to see you in a couple weeks with a new video. Y'all stay safe out there and I will see you next time. That was fun. That was fun. That was fun.